Max Defense Philippines reported that the Department of National Defense already released recently the 15% initial funding for the Philippine Air Force attack helicopter acquisition project and said to be favoring the Turkish aerospace industry. Max Defense Philippines also said several months ago that the contract between the Department of National Defense and Turkish Aerospace Industry have already been signed. The sources of Max Defense Philippines said that due to American sanctions, Turkish Aerospace Industry is having a hard time of securing American-made helicopter engine, the Light Helicopter Turbine Engine Company or LHTEC, CTS-800 turbine engine, with no target date. The Turkish aerospace industry was also said to be pushing for the contract to be valid after Turkish aerospace industry securing turbine engines from the United States. Max Defense Philippines also reported months ago the Turkish aerospace industry is developing indigenous helicopter engine. Max Defense said that this would take several years before it can be used and sold. The indigenous engines still need integration with the Turkish Aerospace Industries T129B attack helicopter and type certification, this issue is something that the Philippine Air Force and the Department of National Defense cannot accept. Turkey did not confirm yet if they already secure LHTEC, CTS-800 turbine engine from the United States. Max Defense said that the Department of National Defense was expected to only release the notice to proceed in the dispersing the recently released 15% initial payment for the attack helicopter acquisition project after the requirements has been met. For now, it is impossible for Turkey to get approval from the U.S. government due to poor relationship between the United States and the Republic of Turkey after the acquisition of Russian defense system and the involvement of Turkey in the Syrian war. End.